Welcome back to Houston Life. You know, all this week the KPRC team will be at different spots around town. We're handing out special solar eclipse glasses to protect your eyes for the solar eclipse. We're giving them out to our KPRC to inside it. Right, we try to spoil you all. Not only will you get two eclipse glasses, but you'll also get to spin our prize wheel for some KPRC2 swag. Derek Shore is hanging out right now at Discovery Green. Hey, Derek. What's up, Tessa and Mel? It is such a beautiful day down here at Discovery Green, and my heart is so full and warm because we have met so many KPRC2 viewers and insiders who specifically came out to Discovery Green just so they could hang out with us, get their glasses. Uh, one gentleman even took the bus all the way from the Galleria area down Westheimer to get here. So thank you, Mr. Ed. We appreciate the fact that you stopped by. Uh, we have a group of special needs seniors over here who stopped by early. They are from down south in Pearland. And as you can see, we've got a whole line of folks, including even a bunny, waiting to spin, or the bunny's owner rather, waiting to spin our KPRC2 insider wheel. It's very, very easy. All you have to do is show us on your phone that you have signed up for free to become a KPRC2 insider. You get to spin the wheel, win some stuff. We've got t-shirts, we're giving away pens, even giant bubble makers. And of course, you get a couple pairs of those special solar glasses. You want to protect your eyes when you are viewing the equips. Also, in case you didn't see Houston Life yesterday, the Houston Camera Exchange there on Richmond, they have partnered with KPRC2 for this giveaway. That's Hillary Shoemaker right there giving us a wave, uh, handing out the glasses along with two of our insiders getting their glasses. And it's been so fascinating hearing Hillary's conversations because Hillary, you're not just giving away these glasses today, you're helping educate people who have a lot of questions about the eclipse. Yeah. So eclipses aren't that common and so not everyone is fully versed on what you need for it, uh, whether it be for just viewing the eclipse or taking photos of the eclipse. So we're here to tell people exactly what they need. Well, you're even breaking down the different types of eclipses because someone came up and they said, didn't we just have a solar eclipse last fall? But last fall's eclipse was a little different than the one we're having in April. It was. So the last eclipse in October was an annual eclipse, which is the, the ring of fire. It's a little red around the edges. You can still see mm -hmm. the ring of the sun. Yeah. And so the, the annual eclipse is going to be this one. That's what's coming up on April 8th. And you're going to have that beautiful corona around the sun, um, that, that, that's what we're all looking for. Yeah, so the annular eclipse, the sun will be totally blocked uh, by the moon. If you're in the Austin area, other parts of the state, but even here in Houston, people will still be able to get a great view of it. Yeah, you'll be able to get about 96% totality um, in Houston if you don't want to go all the way up into the hill country uh, or if you weren't able to get a hotel room, but we're going to have a great view here and it's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, it absolutely will. Okay, so Hillary's already given away a ton of glasses, but have no fear. There is still a very large stack to give away. We've got a lot of uh, KPRC2 swag to give away, some pens, some beach balls, the t-shirts. And in case you are interested, you can visit our website, click to Houston.com slash insider, where you can find more information, just, not just about our spring break solar blast week and all the different locations where you can find us throughout the rest of this week, but also our friends at Houston Camera Exchange, they're doing a really cool photography class. So no matter what kind of camera you shoot on, they're experts will show you how to set up your camera so that you can safely photograph the eclipse with your camera. You can even do it with a smartphone or an iPhone. So uh, mark your calendars for April 8th. That is when this next annular eclipse will be happening. But for now, I'm Derek Shore, live from Discovery Green. And check out this line of viewers just waiting to spin this wheel. A perfect day to win some swag and, of course, those solar sunglasses. So Tessa Mel, for now, I will send it back to you. But I'll be checking back in. Don't worry. Okay, oh keep checking okay. in with us. Tell everyone we say hello. And, yes. uh, yeah, we'll make our way out there soon. Soon. Keep it up. Keep up the good work. Isn't this so cool? This is what they're getting. These, these are these. Oh yes. These. No. Well, my them. coworker at my other job was like, "Where can I get those?" I'm like, "You have to be an insider. Are you an insider?" Yeah. Okay. I'm an insider. <laughs> you have to too. sign up. <laughs>Welcome back to Houston Life. I'm Derek Shore coming to you live from Discovery Green. Happy spring break and also happy spring break solar blast week. In case you're just tuning in all week long, our Houston Life and KPRC2 crew will be at 
different locations around town handing out special solar glasses so you can view the eclipse safely. That eclipse is coming up on April 8th. But in the meantime, Discovery Green, I'm so glad that this is where I landed on this Tuesday. Frankie Ortega is the director of marketing here at Discovery Green. And thank you for hosting us today, Frankie. Oh, thank you so much for coming out. This is our EOG Resources phenomenal spring break. We're so happy you could be here. Okay, so phenomenal spring break. We told our viewers before the break that there are all kinds of vendors and booths. Uh, the Collaborative for Children is down there. KPRC2 is here with our Storm Tracker. Talk to us, Frankie, about the programming you have here this week because it's not just STEM, it is STEAM. You're including the arts. That's right. It is all about STEAM. So it's science, technology, engineering, arts, and math. Um, and of course, Discovery Green Conservancy is a nonprofit. We can't do what we do without our friends. So we've got EOG Resources here. They've got some demonstrations about science and engineering and technology. We've got Girl Start, which is a nonprofit that does STEM for girls. Uh, we've got the Orange Show um, Collab Lab, uh, which is like a mobile museum. Uh, it's been just a lot of fun. Um, also, we have the Rink Open special hours, 11 to 11. 11 p.m. Uh, you know, that's a great way to learn physics. Um, I learned some physics the hard way uh, a few weeks ago. Hopefully, um, y'all can learn some physics the easy way. You mean by falling down on the rink? Yes, yeah. So, Don't worry, we've all been there. <laughs> uh, but, you know, it's just a great time to get out. We've got lots of performances every day, 12 to 4. Um, we had some drum lessons earlier. We've got mad science out there, you know, blowing things up and showing you how things work. Um, it's just a lot of fun this week. Glad you could be here. Well, we're glad to be here, and I'm glad to witness it. I mean, you've got kids running through bubbles over here. There are some science experiments going on under these tents. The number of field trippers we have met today of all ages, there's laughter. People are running. People are hanging out, uh, blowing bubbles, getting their KBRC2 Insider solar glasses. And as Frankie just mentioned, every single day this week, from 12 to 4, you're going to find all kinds of booths set up. So activities for the kids. If people are at home wondering what to do this week, come to Discovery Green. doesn't cost a dime to come. Absolutely. It's free. The only thing is uh, the roller rink is $12, which is still not much. Um, and that's uh, your skates are included. Um, let's see. Tomorrow we have mariachi music. We have dance. Thursday, we have Lee's Golden Dragon is going to come do a lion dance. Have you seen that? That is, sure it have. is so much fun. Um, and then Friday is, uh, I'm very excited for this. It's Moving Mountains by Sunkist. And it's a dance troupe. They, they will build a wall and they dance up and down the wall. It's, it's going to be really exciting. And that is on Friday. So. Okay. Frankie Ortega, thank you so much for your time. As you can see, Mel and Tessa, all kinds of activities going on this week at Discovery Green. And KPRC2 is glad to be here today. I'll send it back to you. Oh, fantastic. That's good if you're looking for something to do with the kiddos. Yes, busy, yeah. busy, busy. And then you get outside. Derek Shore, thank you so much. And remember, Lauren will be down at Moody Gardens tomorrow. She'll be handing out those special glasses courtesy of Houston Camera Exchange as our spring break solar blast week continues. And you know what? If you want to get your hands on those glasses, make sure you become a KPRC insider first. You can do that at click2houston.com. Just head down to the island and, um, you know, meet up with Lauren Kelly. Grab your solar eclipse glasses and protect your eyes. That's right. Full eclipse. And you get out to the island, too, so that's like a yeah. bonus. I love going to Galveston. <laughs> I go a lot. <laughs>